We're happy to have Justin back with us to talk about another potential energy saving system. This is a hot water circulation system. Justin, explain to us what that is and how it works. Well, what this system does is it pushes the hot water from the water heater immediately out to the furthest fixture in a loop. Why does it go all the way out to the furthest fixture? Well, on the way out there, it's passing everything else in the house, so everything else is immediately getting that hot water as fast as the end fixture. Okay, so it hits the laundry, the dishwasher, yeah, everything every it passes. sink along yep. the way. Yep. It sounds like that might use more energy. How do you keep that efficient? It learns the homeowner's usage and then it'll adapt to that so it only turns on during those major uses times. It also has a, a temperature setting where it has a probe on the water line back here where it'll sense the certain temperature of water and only turn on and off at certain points. Okay, let's talk about the cost of the system. What's the price range? Um, depending on the install, it's about eight to $1,200. That's a pretty broad range. What would the circumstances be that might require the higher end of that figure? Um, some basements are finished, so you'd have to cut holes and feed that line all the way to the furthest fixture. So ideally, this is like new construction? Yeah, new construction, and if your basement isn't finished. Okay. Can you walk us through an installation process and explain how the system works as you go? Absolutely. So you put a T in before the furthest fixture at the end of the house and you run a water line back it goes through your recirc pump which then pumps it down into the water heater and then that pump pumps it out this way. So it's making this constant loop and um, water is always in there so it, when you turn on the faucets it's instant hot water. Where you save money is at the faucet. That minute you're waiting for the hot water to get there all that water is going down the drain. I can't imagine. So instead of waiting three minutes in my big old house for the water to come, it would just be immediate. Yeah, right. It'll be right there, right when you need it. That's a lot of water savings. Yeah. So how is the water heated in this system? Is it a traditional tank water heater or could you use a tankless one? You can use them both. Um, the tankless water heater has an option that you can buy. It's a separate model that has that recirculation port and there's a pump already inside there that has the same adapting ability as this pump here. Oh, so it's already built into that particular unit. Yeah. And this is the actual unit itself. It's yeah, really yep. small. Under what circumstances would you recommend a product like this? Um, ideal situation would be is when your water heater is really far away from your furthest fixture. I mean, you want the hot water right there. It might take a minute. This guy will get it there right away. Um, smaller houses, um, it's, it would still be getting the hot water there faster, but it wouldn't be saving as much money and energy. Right, for people that have sprawling homes and the laundry's all the way on the other end. Right. Yeah, that yep. makes sense. Yep. Great, good information. Your local plumbing professional is a great resource to provide you more information on the costs and benefits of a hot water recirculation system for your powerhouse.